Hello fellow YouTubers and photographers. Today I'll show you a quick tip of how to enhance your pictures and look more professional if you need to process it further in other softwares. So before we begin, if you're new here, click subscribe, like and share. I'm trying to get as more subscribers as possible and teach as more photographers how to edit the pictures and quick quick uh, jump their photography careers and how they can start making money on you on not just on youtube but also on through editing the pictures to their various clients without them complaining so without wasting time if you're new here click subscribe like and share this will help me to create more content to uh, show all the photographers around the world on how to earn quick money with photography so without saying we are done i have a picture with me of a beautiful model right took i met her i was not in the right way um and it was one of the earliest pictures that i was taking and so it was it was taken with a nice of 800 uh with a shutter speed of 160 1 over 60 and a departure of, uh, of 25 and so what i'd like to do if you don't know what to do and maybe you want to edit the pictures as quick as possible first of all come here to the auto adjust and click auto adjust you can remove some of them like rotation keystone but it helps to correct the pictures if you never took it with the right rotation so if you click auto adjust it will just automatically and see if i show you it has already enhanced a little bit right so part of our work is done part of our work is really done so the next thing you have to do, come here to the plus sign, come here to the new field adjustment layer. After you click the new field adjustment layer, you come here to the high dynamic range, reduce the highlight and also reduce the white. This will help to reveal more information in the picture. Another thing, you can dehaze, but I don't want to dehaze at the moment, especially because the picture is just looking good. I'll come here to the levels reduce this at this far corner a little bit just a little bit right uh, to reveal the reddish color that is there um i'll collapse it then i'll come here to the color editor not the color balance not now i'll show you the color balance later come here come to the green i can see some green and this is where i'm trying to enhance first of all um re reduce the lightness right and increase the saturation all right i know it's now looking really bad because this is not the typical green if you just look at it it's just looking green the good thing with this software is it's better when it comes to color enhancing of the foliage like more than luminar and it's also good more than lightroom when it comes to enhancing that's my opinion and now increase the hue look at how the hue is coming all right all right it's not uh like it's not like the um, the lightroom and other softwares the the vegetation looks as if it's it's just painted with just a brush then another thing you come here i can see some reddish and be careful because now the picture the the, the picture now looks reddish so if i increase it see this is how it will look it will look really bad so be careful on how you are enhancing in fact you can just reduce the lightness right and increase the saturation right after you're done with that you can reduce the hue not uh, not not uh, not not just increases uh, this the the hue sorry this will make it look more better all right then after that um if you want to see the progress come and see the progress this is how you've color graded so far i think it's so good for liking you can go to the skin tone um if you want to make it look better come here to click this point i want the skin tone to look like uh let me let me first of all i want the skin tone maybe to look like this point so what i would like i'll look i'll click here uh this more better 
So I will increase the smoothness first of all. Reduce you can all right reduce the saturation because the the picture was beginning to look really bad <laughs> and i think um for me it's just done i don't want to increase the hue right not maybe a little bit the uniformity you can increase the saturation so that can be more uniform and i think for me the picture is really good for my liking i've already done um lots of things with me and i don't want to over edit this picture this is how you've saved the picture from going to the dustbin and sending it to your client i hope that you've learned something from this and if so click subscribe like and share until next time bye bye